What is up, lit people? I'm Armin and welcome back to another Lumion Legacy video. Guys, in today's video, we actually have an answer to the best starter Lumion in Lumion Legacy based off of scientific, uh, not actually scientific, but based off of data given by T. Bradham. Guys, before you continue this video, please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you have not subscribed yet. Really helps you out a lot. We're almost at 100,000 subscribers and every single subscription counts. Okay, guys, so on May 14th, uh, the Lumion Legacy Wiki account tweeted out the following tweet, which said, Brett showed how many people picked each starter in Pokemon Break Bronze. We think it would be cool if you did this for the Lumion Legacy starters. And they provided this uh, graph that showed how many people picked each starter in Pokemon Break Bronze. I took the time to add them all up, and around 17,000 people uh, chose different starters in Pokemon Break Bronze. So I asked them about this data, and they said that this data is actually um, from the first few months of the game, was out back in 2015. And actually, Brad responded to this tweet, and he said, I imagine there is some bias due to the cutscene just before selecting your Lumion, where we give Feevine a lot more personality than the others. And then he shows this graph that shows basically how much each Lumion has been picked in Lumion Legacy. And according to this graph, Feevine is the most popular Lumion, followed by Eaglet, then Vambat, Weevolt, Snowcup, Empit, then Dripple. Uh, I agree with what Brad said. Before you choose a Lumion, you can see Feevine sleeping. That clearly influenced a lot of people to choose Feevine. So that's the reason why Feevine is one of the most chosen starters. Which is why I'm not gonna even consider Feevine, because there is a clear bias towards Feevine, okay? Feevine should not be the most chosen starter. If Feevine would not have that cutscene before choosing a starter, Feevine would have not been the Lumion to have been chosen the most, which is why, from now on, I am considering Eaglet as the most popular, the most famous, the most chosen starter in Lumion Legacy. Eaglet gang, rise up, we officially did it. Eaglet is now officially the most chosen starter in Lumion Legacy. This feels good. Honestly, I'm super happy about this. Can't believe that Eaglet is the most chosen starter in Lumion Legacy. Also, uh, Brad mentioned that this chart does not involve the software set of a Lumion. So if you software set it for a Lumion, uh, basically this wouldn't influence the chart at all. And I'm quite sure not many people have alt accounts. So I think it is safe to say that Eaglet is the best starter, the most chosen starter, the most popular starter in Lumion Legacy. Some people told me, Armenti, you had a huge influence on this. No, I did not. There's no way I could influence almost a million people to choose Eaglet. Okay, I have only 92,000 subscribers. I don't have a million subscribers. So I'm quite sure I did not influence Eaglet into choosing that. But yeah, pretty, pretty happy about this. Uh, today, I go to sleep as a happy man. Eaglet is the most chosen star in Lumi Legacy. Pretty, pretty good feeling overall. Not gonna lie. But yeah, guys, I do really believe that is going to be everything for today's video. If you guys enjoyed watching, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm Armenti, and we lit. Thanks for watching.